The overall goal of this procedure is to perform single plane illumination microscopy using a light sheet excitation module for inverted microscopes and apply it to three dimensional cell spheroids. This is accomplished by first using a pipette to transfer a cell spheroid from the well of a microtiter plate to a second well to incubate. Following washing, the spheroid is then introduced to a rectangular capillary. The second step is to mount the light sheet illumination module to the base plate of the inverted microscope positioning table. Next, the capillary containing the spheroid is placed in a special sample holder for microscopy. The final step is to set the matching between the light sheet and the focal plane of the microscope objective lens in the detection path. Ultimately, three-dimensional fluorescence measurements can be performed by variation of the focal plane within the cell spheroid to gain information of single images or z-stacks concerning the uptake of drugs or the structure of the spheroid. The main advantage of this technique over existing light sheet microscopes is that it is cost-efficient and highly versatile as it consists of a module that can be adapted to an existing microscope and provides a large degree of freedom for research. The implications of this technique extend towards research of drugs and agents used for therapy and diagnosis, in particular since adaption of the microfluidic system permits investigation of rapid processes under flow conditions. Now, this excitation method, in combination with any detection technique, can provide insight into live cell spheroids at low light doses. It can also be applied to other living systems such as zebrafish or drosophila embryos, as well as optically cleared tissue cells.